I'm going to discuss about how to compress file using command prompt. So here opening the command prompt first and uh, thereafter I'm going to use here new folder location. There I have some files and now changing the directory. So for this one using or CD then after directory that has changed to compress the file we need to use here the command compact after that to uh, this place forward slash then you need to use here C thereafter you need to give the file name so R1 is AVI file video file is there so this that I'm going to compress. You can see this is the size is there. So giving R1 and the extension unit to give AVI. Press enter. So this is now a start doing the compression of file of R1. And since the size is so huge, okay. So this is now you can see this is the size and uh, data are stored and after doing the compression or uh, the size that had changed. And you can see the compression is 2.1 uh, here. So how we can check the compression that's uh, actually open. So for this one go to the properties. Then you can see here. Or uh, this is now or uh, taking the uh, the file size is now uh, 64 611 MB and after doing the compression it's now taking here 295 MB okay and uh, if you compare with the R2 uh, then here let's go on these properties so R2 170 170 is there okay so now if I go here doing the R2 this times 170 is there so now it's uh, start doing the compression so 1.8 and the size is 1 this one and after or uh, that the bytes that's come there let's uh, check or uh, or uh, this times so this is 170 after doing the compression this is 97.1 MB that's come there now uh, this is the compression and if you want to do here or uh, uncompression for uncompression you need to use here the same things or uh, here writing compact and uh, this times you need to use here you and give the file name so here i'm going to show you one more times of the R2 details so R2 details let's uh, see so here this is now 170 97 MB is there and uh, uh, giving here R2 dot AVI press enter so R2 that uncompressed and uh, here you can see the details of the R2 is now 170 170 original size size disk that's all 170 this time that's gone now the next is this is uh, doing the compression of uh, one files 100 times if you want to do here compression of multiple files okay so uh, for multiple files you no need to give here particular file name you just write here a star start then this will start doing the compression of this all press enter then you can see this is uh, doing uh, uh, compression of this all so here you can see this is 723 here this is now huge file 9000 this comp after compression 8000 here to that's come and here this is the 170 and after doing this compression and this is now 7000 and after that 
this is now 4000 that's come so if the file size is the huge that's to the compression as or uh, compression that's not required now the next uh, here if you for uncompression you simply you need to write here u okay so if i press enter this is now or uh, doing the uncompression 16 files on compress and if you want to do the compression of uh, file inside uh, or uh, inside or directory or subdirectory so here you need to write here backwards slash s backwards slash s then here write s star press enter so inside uh, subdirectory this is also doing the compression okay if the file inside uh, subdirectory then it's uh, doing the compression inside the subdirectory if the file present there so there are three subdirectories there if i go on this item you can see some files is there okay so this is doing the compression of this all so st that's come this size after reducing and uh, here one one that's come there now the next is uh, to uncompress you need to simply write here or uh, you this is to the uncompression of directory subdirectory everywhere 49 to 6 directory was uncompressed so this is how we can compress on and compress the files or uh, using command prompt so i hope guys this video is the helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you